Welcome to week two of Belly Dancing for Fitness with me, Lindsay Marie Silver, here at Little Egypt Studio in Scotland. If you remember in the last session, we had lots of fun working particularly with leggies. In this session, let's go a little bit further in our fitness journey and let's start to really tone, strengthen and shape through our belly, our waist and our back. Loads of fun movements, it's going to be really awesome and of course there's going to be lots of shimmying in there too. Let's dive in! Was it like setting everything up for the event it was also dismantling it all and getting it all back how we need it for our session so that's been tricky but yeah it's done so as you might recall in the last session we had a lot of fun working through various different shimmies and belly dance movements in a fun fitness way and we particularly focused in on leggies <laughs> in this session, I thought, well, why not? Let's pop that bubble on the belly aspect of fitness. Let's tone and strengthen and like shape up through our belly, waist and back. You're going to feel stronger and fitter and you're going to feel like your metabolism has been boosted and like you've got way more energy than you had before. How does that sound as a session for today? Amazing, all the thumbs are going up here. Woohoo! All right, let's dive in. Let's dive in. So get yourself into position, help yourself to some hydration, and then we are jamming to the sounds of Miss Thea. I'm going to ease us in gently with this one. Thinking all my volume levels are around about where we usually have them. Let me know if something needs adjusted. Drop a little comment in the comments box. That would be really helpful. But as far as I could see from testing, this is where we want things. All right, so we're gonna start off with a lovely basic march. Lift the knees up a bit higher. Easing it into this one. So. Whenever we say belly dance, of course, the first thing that we think of is the abdomen region, all around your belly. So much of belly dance is actually driven by the knees and other parts of the body. But there are many, many movements which focus in on strengthening, toning, gaining power, control over the muscles of the belly, those superficial muscles that we can see and then the deeper muscles beyond. Let's tap out to the side. So we're going to start with a light warm up. We're going to build it up into cardiovascular workout. Boost your circulation. Wow, that looks gorgeous already. Let's bring our hands to hips. I'm gonna bring your heel to the ground. All right, into center. We're gonna lift your one heel then through the other. We're gonna get our calf muscles going. Calf muscles known as your second heart. They help to really pump blood around your system. So we're starting off with a gentle workout in this session and then believe me, we're going to build it right up. So you're going to hear, you could emphasize that lowering of your heel down so you feel this ricochet through your body. You feel that shimmy effect throughout your whole body. Keep the knees soft though, relax through your shoulders. Every time that your heel comes to the ground and you feel that downwards gravitational pull. You're actually pulling toxins out of your system. You're returning them 
towards kidneys and liver to be processed and eliminated by your body. And actually your kidneys and your liver, we don't necessarily think about them as being part of fitness. But actually without strong and healthy kidneys and liver, it's very difficult to boost well-being in general and therefore obtain higher fitness levels. So it's really nice just to spend a bit of time there on that movement. Now we're gonna work to bring the hip up and out. We're gonna hit to the side. Nice strong legs, nice soft knee movement there. And we're gonna speed that up a little bit. Here we go. Are you ready? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, yes. Hit the hip up and out. All right, now we're gonna add in one of these crazy movements. Shoulders, if you want to. Hit, shoulders, hit, shoulders, hit, shoulders, hip, shoulders, hip, shoulders. All right, here is an option if you would like it. Hit, roll up, shoulders. Hit with the hip, roll up, reverse camel into shoulder shimmy. Hit, roll up, shoulders. <laughs> Hit, roll up, shoulders. Make that all one movement. Hit, roll up, shoulders. Hit, roll up, shoulders. <laughs> Let's do a single hit. And then we're gonna flip that and we're gonna do a drop of the hip. Here it goes, one side then the other. Take it to the corners. Shoulders if you want. Three, four, shoulders, two, three, four. Two, three, four, shoulders, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, shoulders, two, three, four. Drop, two, three, four, shoulders, two, three, four. Wee! Wow, amazing combinations, everybody. Help yourself to some hydration. And now let's go deeper. Let's go deeper. How's everybody doing in here? Paulette, woohoo! Rosa's like getting some hydration. Yes, love it. So is Isla, woohoo! Marge has got the thumbs up going on. Do the thumb dance, do the thumb dance. Katie, I have a top like this. It's lovely. <laughs> I love that fluid feminine look. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four. Okay, so are you ready to really tone, strengthen, shape, and just feel like all together through your belly, your waist, and your back? Are you ready? All right, if you're ready, if you feel ready, let's go. We're gonna get with the camel movement. We're gonna lift, roll down, lift, roll down. You could travel that if you want to. One foot slightly in front of the other. Other side, here we go. Other foot comes in front. Oh, it's smooth, it's fluid. Here we are. So what you're doing, of course, if you'd like a refresher of the technique of this, you can visit the beginners playlist on our YouTube channel. That goes for everybody who's joining me here, woo, live. And if you're playing this on the Rewind, <laughs> if you're catching up on YouTube, it's there for you as well. But what we're doing, lift up, roll down, knees bend hips tilt. So on the playlist, the beginner's playlist, I of course break this down in terms of technique, all the details, how it should feel, how it shouldn't feel, what it's doing for you. 
But let's assume you are familiar with that technique. We could do that double time. So you want to focus on making that movement even between the front of the body and the back of the body. Really use your abs. Whew. Do you want to reverse that? Here we go. Roll up, lift, roll up, roll up, roll up, up, up. Yes! That was spectacularly amazing. I must say that was pretty good. Are you ready to take it up a notch? Okay, here we go. We're going with the combo. So we've got one up, one down. One up, one down. So here we're combining the legs that we did last week with the belly. Up and down. Lift up onto toes and then flat foot bend to your knees. Other side, lift, roll down. <laughs> lift, roll down, lift, roll down. Woo! One more here. Other side. Oh yeah. Are you starting to feel more at home in your body? Hopefully. Let's bring a shimmy. Shake it out. Shimmy down. Next movement. So we're gonna twist through the waist, slide diagonal. Slide, twist. Slide, twist. Try to keep your hips facing forwards. Now, if you're really up for a challenge, you could sit right down into a lunge there. Sit down into that squat position there. Bring your hips into neutral. Use pelvic floor. Two, three, four. You could lunge one side, then the other. One, two, three, four. So the main part of this movement is coming through that twist of the waist. The hips remain facing forwards. Yes, everybody's giving that lots of welly here in this live session. Wow. Keep the hips in neutral. Woo! Nice long lean straight muscles of the back. Imagine that you've got gigantic vase of water on your head. <laughs> you don't want to spill a drop. Woo! Yes. You could try bring your hands out to the side. Really fluid through there. Okay, from here. So this is a horizontal figure of eight through the rib cage. Let's turn it vertical now. We're gonna bend. Yep, bring it up and around. Up, so it's through the rib cage and round. Here we go. Slide up, round. You bring that shoulder roll if you want to. Oh yeah. But we're only bringing that in as a secondary effect. The first aspect of this movement is definitely waist, belly, and back. So you're gonna extend through and contract. Extend, contract. And the opposite is happening on the other side. It's extending and contracting uh, in an alternate motion. <laughs> Woo! You can bring that low. Lift the heels if you want. Slide that rib cage. Oh, wow. Center. Bring the hands center, make that movement smaller and faster. Bring the knees wide if you're going in for that lunge. Woo, feel it. <laughs> yes. Okay, now you understand why I started us off nice and steady and slow. Gently does it. Here we're gonna slide the rib cage one side to the other. Slide straight across. Bring the hands out. That ancient Egyptian angular movement. Take it low. Woo, squeeze through your glutes. Bring them back into center. Wow. Well, that was pretty darn good. Help yourself to some hydration. You're probably needing it by now. <laughs> wow. Oh yes, let's do some omies, yeah? We're gonna drop, tuck, drop, tilt, drop, tuck, drop, tilt, drop, tuck, drop, tilt, drop, tuck, drop, tilt. Take it round. 
bit faster if you want to. Woo! Oh yeah. So we took one foot back. Only on a single leg with a dip. <laughs> I know, right? It's challenging. Let's try that on the other side. Take it to the other direction. Are you ready? Here we go. So we're gonna drop, tuck, drop, tilt, drop, tuck, drop, tilt. So we're circling around the other direction this time when we build it up after we've marked it out in that diamond shape. Here it goes. <laughs> Whee! <laughs> Thank you to everybody who's joining us here live. Without your support, you guys, it would be nigh on impossible for Little Egypt to be probably still here after the year that we've had. <laughs> we had to close our doors over a year ago. All sources of income completely ceased. <laughs> the universe has a sense of humor, right? <laughs> so thank you so much for your support. And if you are here supporting us on YouTube, it is so amazing to connect with you. If it wasn't for COVID, we might not have met. Welcome to the tribe. If you didn't already, hit subscribe. Take it the other way around. Turn on notifications. Ding, ding, ring that victory bell. <laughs> Click like, leave a comment. Let us know how you like in this movement. Are you ready? Don't worry, I didn't forget. One side always feels like it doesn't want to go. Here we go. <laughs> Bring it up. Yes, well done. Take it down, dip down. Yeah. Woo. Again. <laughs> Belly and legs. <laughs> <laughs> shimmy it out, shake it out, shimmy down. Oh, so good, huh? Shoulders. <laughs> Other side. Here we go. Woo! Other side. Yes, drop, tuck, drop. So it's with a kick or without. <laughs> amazing camels. I mean, you are amazing. Let's do camels. <laughs> well, look, there are some amazing camels. <laughs> <laughs> Wee! Choo choo! Or baby seagull. <laughs> I don't know why that's becoming a thing, but uh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Wee! <laughs> of course, that lean back is just, if it feels right for you, you can stay here. If not, here we go. Woo! Wow! Woohoo! <laughs> Help yourself to some hydration. That was spectacularly awesome. How did it feel? Let me know in the comments, guys. Wow, oh, I'm using the wrong mouse. <laughs> Let's finish up. Woo, do you feel it? Ooh, yes. Abs are like, yeah, 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 yeah. Exactly, right? We're gonna finish up with the combo. 
So we're gonna do like a chicken. We're gonna pop up and pull down. Pop up and drop. Lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, drop, lift, drop. We're gonna do that on a V-shaped diagonal. Lift, 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 lift. Drop, drop, drop. Hold me. We did. Do you remember? Hit, roll up, shoulders. Other side. Hit, roll up, shoulders. A bit faster if you want to. Hit, roll up, shoulders. Hit, roll up, shoulders. Hit, roll up, shoulders. Hit, roll up, shoulders. A big high five. Everyone's like, how am I doing that? Is it just like this? Let me show you how to do. How to high five yourself in the bestest of ways. It goes like this. Yeah! <laughs> Give yourself one of those. You did amazingly. So, if you want a little bit more strengthening and toning and shaping of belly, waist, and back, just know I got a hell of a lot more coming up for you in this term. We're just getting started. <laughs> Woo! Let's come into center. Bend to your knees, deep breath in. And as you breathe out, we're gonna bend your knees and just release it out to your back, to your neck, your shoulders, your arms. And unwind one individual vertebra at a time. Up to the top, deep breath in here. Release it out. Oh. Let's do one more of those. Deep breath in. One time. Breathing out. Oh. Back to center here. Wow. Stretch out through waist, back, into center. Wow, other side, just to keep things nice and even. Release it out through your back, bring it into center, and coming all the way back up. Woo, give me a power stance, four, three, two, one. Yes! Wow. Welcome home to you. Welcome home within your own body feeling aligned and totally alive. Enjoy that sensation. And we'll see you in the next one.